He's practiced law in Florida for nearly half a century while serving multiple terms in the Florida House of Representatives and State Senate. Along the way, he's been devoted to his local Sarasota community and to his alma mater, and in fact helped forge a strategic alliance that benefits both through the marriage of the John and Mabel Ringling Museum of Art and FSU. The alignment of the Ringling with FSU secured the museum's grounds restoration and future, and provided FSU with a crown jewel for its portfolio, one of the largest museum university complexes in the nation, and the extraordinary collection of art amassed by the late circus tycoon John Ringling. Senator Johnson didn't limit his Florida state impact to the arts. As a state senator, he was a key player in helping FSU and the state of Florida land the National High Magnetic Field Laboratory. More than two decades later, the Mag Lab remains a fixture at FSU and at the forefront of our scientific world as the only facility of its kind in the U.S. The foundation for Johnson's illustrious career was laid at FSU where he earned a degree in political science, then took flight in the Air Force and received distinguished unit awards from Presidents Eisenhower and Kennedy. Later in life, he was appointed by President Ronald Reagan to the National Council of the Arts, where he served from 1985 through 1993. He's been inducted into Omicron Delta Kappa, Gold Key, and the Florida State University Hall of Fame, and is also a Circle of Gold member and a recipient of the Westcott Medal of Lifetime Service Award. Today, we add another feather to the Florida State cap of an individual who moved from the big top to the big stage. Please congratulate Senator Bob Johnson, FSU class of 1958, and a 2012 grad made good.